Alrighty then, folks. Hello there, and welcome back to tomorrow. It's the Gundam Generations Cross Race. It is time for yet more of that wing, specifically for the scenario for Bloodshed. Ain't that a title? I know I say that every time, but damn. What do you got? We got Build Marshal Noveta has Control Two or Prisma. Control Two is useful. Reflex, Strategist. Hmm. I think I'm just gonna do normal this time, just because I know the enemy. It's probably not gonna be too enemy spammy. Now nah, you know what? Let's do hard. Yeah, yeah. Dun dun dun. A weird Gundam no shizugengo. Colony no ishi o tashikameru be ku uchu e to agatta Dorian Gaimu Jika. Shikashi, kare no goe o tsutomeru specials no Lady Ann wa hisoka ni kekaku shite ita. Dorian Gaimu Jika no ansatsu kekko. Lady Yoon, everyone's favorite character. Guzen ni mo sono ba ni yasta Lady Ann wa ima wa no Dorian kara jishin no shin no shusse o shirasareru koto to natta. Lilina Peace Craft. Kaste Kanzen Hewa o Tonai Nagara, Horobi o Yoginak Sareta Boko no Osho. Sorega, Kanojoni Kasserareta Ume de Ari, Mata Shime de Moatta. So stay, Lady Yan no Tekara Kuish Sareta Kanojoa, Chikasoski no Ajito de Omoigakena Jimbus to Dea Koto to Naru. Was it perhaps Greg from White Castle? No, is this creepy old man? Sono no, Doctor J. Wing Gundam in twenty years. Me in twenty years. Hero Yuho, Gundam pilot to toshite sodate ageta jinbuts. Should beat that kid more. Kono Doctor J kara Lily na wa hero no namae ga code name de aru koto. Mata kare koso ga jibun tachi koroni kyojuu sha no daiben sha de aru koto. He was perhaps named Hero. Because he used to be a hero. No, not at all. So she. On like Kareva, Junsuina Yasashi Kokoro Motta Shonen de Arkoto Shiru. Gonna make a joke, but it's just kind of like. Yeah, it's really sad that he got bent to his little. Oh, Kate to Ketsui to Tomoni. Chikue to Kikan Stadi Rina. Gakuen was a lot to stay the hero Nikizuki. Kareo Yobitometa. Doctor J. Nyatava. Nani. What? Anata de Modorok Kotogarunone. But Axua Hajimete Anata Nyata Tokikara, Odoroka Sarete Bakari Dakedo. Hero. What Axua Sidi Sugitava. Yapari. Korosarunone. Ah, so da. Nani Mowakara Nai Mama Shinuno Ayadata. でも今は違う。あなたが戦う気持ちがわかる。I kind of like what they did with the old audio clips. They cleaned them up real good. 私も今ヒーローと戦っている。That being said, I don't know if it's Heroes too because he didn't talk too much, but they definitely upstarted some of Rulinas. リリーナの瞳に映る決意の色。それは。I suppose they could have re-recorded some old ones using some old techniques. But the digital quality is still nicer than it was back in the day, so... Unless they had, like, mics from back in the day that still work. Oh, his name was Rashid, not Rashid. My bad. Uh, these are the Magnac. Basically, they're uh, they're the Kurds, kind of. 
They're in the Middle East. They were crushed, except for the Barton Foundation decided to help them, and so they owe Troa a lot. We also had like 30 or so mobile suits built so they could act as a rebel army. Everyone in the show is such downer, man. Man, that's a lot of Leos. That's like 12 whole Leos. It's almost enough to take over a whorehouse. Also, quite a bit of shuttles, actually. I don't know how you guys got them parked that way. I guess you could taxi them, but... That means you can only launch the first two at any time. You know, no normal human, like, looks at history like these people do. Like, I get it, you want to help the future people, but, like, is everyone a narcissist in this? It's like, well, everything I do has to help the future. I'm not wasting my time doing something stupid. Have indeed become the military powers yourself. Oh, it's this dude who has the awesome voice. Like, look up the sound clip. This is the best. At least for the English dub. It's the exact quality you would expect for it. Yes, we know about this metal, and we have some of it ourselves. It's so great. But they could only have gotten it in space. Wait, what do you mean our stockpiles of Gundarium have gone down? Eh, it's fine. It has to be those space noids. They're evil. They must have robbed us and not given us our share. I mean, they probably actually use that excuse. I mean, you know, if they were normal kids, totally. But the people they have here, they're all like sociopaths and they don't want to admit it. And they talk about pacifism and then do stupid shit that causes more conflict. I'm mostly talking about Rolina here, let's be real. Not as bad as Lycus, but still pretty bad. This is a uh, pro emo. No, this is that side. I was wrong. 
That is the Buster Rifle. Also, I think he missed. That is that type. But your name literally means two. Because you're the second one. Welly well. Troa. I saw that one coming. I mean, then again, it was literally a coin flip. Yeah. See, the Heavy Arms has an unlimited supply of ammunition. It, it Two-thirds of its body mass is, devo uh, is devoted to its missile storage. That's how it fires so many missiles. And then it fires that same amount of missiles again. It just, you know, grabs the metal off the ground and manufactures them in a quarter of a second. Why no one else used that technology, we don't know, but it's useful. Stop with the siren, please. Okay. Can Hero destroy Novita's shuttle? Destroy Novita's shuttle. Um, that's what I was looking for. So let's see, Duo is, yeah. We don't have the Death Scythe, we have the EU Death Scythe. Hero defeats Novita's beam, uh, Novita with the beam saber. Is he... Okay, so he's... No, he's not captaining it. He's... So do we destroy him, or do we destroy someone late? We'll do both. It's fine. Alright, so... Death of Saifu...
行くぜ相棒こういう武器の扱いには自信があってね覚悟しな Not gonna lie, I honestly expected that to one shot him. <laughs> but it works. So I chose the one that was close to Hero, so. Okay, get to do some damage and. Alright. Now we go here. We sorty. Hmm. Ah, I can't gigantic scissor that guy. Dang. I like how even the Astron just doesn't care. It's just like, yeah, I'm leaving. Bye. They have basic machine guns. Blah. Target to Kakunin. ニムを遂行する。邪魔だ。俺の邪魔をするな。蹴られたのか。行け。Do we want to gigantic scissor them, or do we want to sortie someone else? Yeah, the thing looks like a more evil version of a legend. Like, yeah, we got the legend and we just covered it in giant cannons and faces for some reason. Um, the things on its shoulder are actually, uh... They're like mobile mines or something like that. I forgot what the exact wording they used for it is. But they're unmanned mobile suits that are that's controlled by Veda. And it can actually fire them, like, in three directions at once. It's kind of crazy. So my plan is to Sono Yuasa Yono Hate de Kamishimeru ga yoitsu yeah, my plan is to damage as many in front of them as we can, and then move the ship up and hit people behind it. Sorty. The Jagadoga. Ah. Uh, can't GN anyone? No. I mean, I guess we could GN Fang these guys.
これにて幕引きじゃシャレとるじゃろこっちんの仏はガンダムじゃからやっぱりええのガンダムはははなんだと <laughs> Hell of that massive explosion. Yeah, only 4,000 damage. Let me guess. If we go up here, we worship Link. Yeah, we'll only be able to hit five guys, so let's hit these guys. Now we can deploy, like, say, the Kamaris. Not nearly as close as I thought, but that's fine. See, my plan was to kill those guys, move the, or deploy the next group of people up to hit the next group of enemies. That being said... Oh yeah, there's still, like, three lines deep. Okay, that should still be a experience. Oh wow, you you can GN Feng this guy. We haven't seen the Tragos back yet. about what I expected. I don't have you pinned down. You just got shot by like a ranging shot. True. That did only do about 10% of your HP. Um, so I talked about it a little bit last episode, but I had a uh, Tragos being used in my IBO game, or uh, my MS Saga game. And like, they destroyed the tower that was controlling the mobile dolls, right? So it lost power, but right before they had done that and noticed that it had happened, they were trying to melee the thing because it had no melee, so it didn't counter them. And they kept trying to melee it. And the AI that was controlling that thing dodged every single time except for the very last one where they sliced off the back of its hover sled. Jamada. They slice off the back of the thing's hover sled, like, as it tries to dodge them. It pulls back, kind of spins around a little bit, and fires point blank into their face. The rounds don't detonate, but it just slams the dude in the face. Because most bullets, or most cannons like that, have, like, minimum time before the shell will actually explode, especially if they're guided like that. And it hadn't flown far enough to actually detonate, so it just slaps him straight in the face. But yeah, you spent 20 minutes trying to beat me up. Well, fuck you. Okay, the Gallus Gel. I know I should have expected that, but kind of hoping for something a little bit more deadly. Oh well. Who's movement? Novitas? Um, Dreadnought Gundam? Uh, K 
can't large beam saber him, so we'll just beam rifle him. Oh, we can't halberd anyone. I mean, I guess we could move to like right here and then halberd them. But not just yet. to move out of the way. Get yeah, shot from the thorax. Actually, it's a uh, hexapod, so it's not even an arachnid. Yeah, it only has six legs, not eight legs. So technically, it's not even an arachnid, so I can't make that joke. I could make the joke, but I shouldn't. That's not a halberd. That's a bar each. That blade is like more than a handspan. <laughs> Yeah, it's like a great axe or a party. What else do you have, Kragos? Just beam, beam rifle and cannon. Okay, that makes about as much sense as I thought it would. Four ship link. Oh, I only have three people deployed. Quanta. That was cool. Manual Dori no course. Totemo e Kyozai de Suane. Want to do something more exotic like Death Sight? Nah, not Death Sight. Your range isn't sadly good enough. Or is sadly not good enough. Isn't sadly good. English is my second language, everyone. Snipe, cool. Beam rifle, no cannon. Oh, 
We're doing this exactly to provoke the beam rifle attack. All the way up to here. Go you, 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 and you. I'm going to deploy you to here. Oh wow. Yeah, I forgot you have like crazy range, don't you? Weirdly enough, the Astroth, while being good at melee, is also a good support suit. Assorty Yusha. I mean, he could. Assorty you. Oh, wait, no. Sort of you, but transform. And then do the mobile armor form. <laughs> Wasn't what I was expecting, but awesome. Kind of annoys me how like grandiose a Leo's explosion is. I know they packed your hole with like 90% explodium, but damn man. Like, you don't need to show off. No. We don't need to ditch the trader for that. So, yeah, those guys are good. I mean, I guess technically we could undock you. Have you heat rod this Tragos? Move you back onto your trader. And finalize. So, I figure we'll move the... We'll move everyone up to, like, right here take on these guys, move the ship kind of as forward as we can and try to hope we can hit those guys while we move the rest over to here. We'll have Hero and them push through to the ship or the shuttle. I wonder, can we move you guys on to... No, we can't move you on to a traitor. Damn. Are you guys in your own group, too? God, why are you guys such divas? Ooh. Alright, so... Maserano. Beam Chakram, this guy.
It's really hard not to do that kind of stuff when everyone gets experience for it. So, while you are sharing out the experience, like you're sharing it out between everyone, it just works. EA piercing. disappointed. Oh well, next time, next time. I should have had him shoot too. I didn't think about it until I had already clicked the button. Alright, so, do you have anyone left to sortie? No. Oh, I could actually depth charge and make it useful in this one, can't I? for what it was. Ah, damn. Sadly, the Calamity does have a, like, really shitty hit chance. I should probably be putting up evasion so that that increases, but I haven't been. So I think evasion's what controls hit chance. Or is it just pilot reflex? It's also entirely possible that it could just be pilot reflex. you to transform and for you to fly all the way right here and then you'll get to here next round and then hit next or the round after that that's fine Beer repair three. Oh, do you have a uh, plus one movement? Quick motion? No. Okay, yeah.
Ooh, I'm gonna use that Leo. I did it good. Which HP do you have? A thousand? Don't want to do that. I could. I really could. It would be fun. I didn't expect it to hit the ship in the back, but that works. Might actually work really well. Transform. Move you to here. Bean Saburu. Ah, oh, no animation. Damn. Oh, I could've almost one-shot him. Beam Saber through Shuttle, almost one-shot. Yeah, makes sense. Don't be rash now, young man. Oh, well, the... The dove is dead. Yet brings time for the hawks. And behind us? Oh no. Again with this other map thing. The field marshal. It's a declaration of war from the colonies. After we want to make peace with them. Now he's gone. Yeah, I, I can't do it. I want to have a Septum voice, but I can't. Interesting note, Septum is also the Dom from Turn uh, from Gundam X. I was about to tur call it the Turn X. I was like, oh, it's the Gundam X. You have to call it the Turn X. But no, the Septum's actually the Dom from Turn X, which I did it. Cool. <laughs> I really like the Janus line in that. I even like the Bertigo. Like they just look so weird and so bulbous. But sadly, the Gelgu, which is the Octon, the Septum, and then the Janus basically all look the same, except for one's orange, one's purple, and one's green, and that's the only way to tell them the part, except for the head Vulcans. Or, uh, head visor. And head Vulcans, technically, because I think the Galgook has it. And that's it. Also, never fire a gun in a shuttle, especially a high-altitude shuttle, where everything's compressed. That will kill you all. Behind us? Thought so. Really, all the enemies assembling in one place and you guys knew about it. As to in which world would killing the president have ended the war?
Then again, I'm pretty sure these guys had never studied military history. After nationalism became a thing, that's just crazy talk. Hey, Sally Poe! It's a preventer! Okay. Oh. Well, shit. It's like 180 miles. Well, yeah, it is 180 miles, isn't it? Because kilometer is 0.6 miles and it's 300 miles. Just bomb the missiles already. Oh, more Ares. I, I, I really wish those were something more exciting than just like, oh hey, it's the same thing you've already fought. Fight it some more. I guess Kreis didn't expect them to bring two warships that have stupidly high range for some reason. Do you think we should upgrade to the Jagged Archie this mission, or next mission, or the mission after? Um, I'm gonna need you guys to move out of the way, please. I'm going to pull you up to here. And you're gonna target that guy. Oh, wait. Xenon's command circle is like two larger than Carta's, I think. Something like that. But he does slightly less damage. It's not as beneficial, but I'm pretty sure all these missiles have, yeah, 1000 HP, so it should be fine. Oh wow, that did not do nearly as much as I thought it would. Well, alright then. Never mind. I should destroy the Tragos first. Um... Hmm. Interesting. Cool, that'll do it.
you know what? Oh, I've already moved you. Damn. I was gonna be like, oh hey, look, Trans Am. Um, Astron. You move up to here to beam saver this guy. All we have left is the scissor beam cannon, which I'm pretty sure we've already seen, but anyway. Yeah, we've seen this. I'm gonna try to evade. Alright, and then... We'll GN sword this guy. It's not gonna kill him, but that's fine. Like you have brought a sword or a knife to a sword fight. Can I hit you with the sea whisk or the large beam? We got a large beam saver this guy, just because I'm curious as to what that means. Guys. Um. I don't know how I should respond to that, actually. Gonna make a joke about those being leather seats, but I think that would be in poor taste. How much HP do you have? 4,000? So I think it might be about time to replace Xenon. Should we go for another named character as that, or should we start moving our um, custom characters? over to ship rolls, and then having the named characters be pilots. I did that in the last game. Gives you more longevity with them. But in the last game, like, stats were way too important. And custom characters were absolutely garbage for whatever reason. Also, I forgot about those guys. That's fine. I know. We destroyed 90% of the missiles in, like, a turn. Like, guys, you only have four minutes till they detonate. Oh, well, it'll only wipe ever everything in the immediate vicinity. There's only two left. Already? Really? here. You can hit this guy. Oh. Um, we want to bump that up. Then go to here. Have you slash this guy. Don't need support.
And you're gonna move up and slash this guy. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, I thought it was that was the end. Come on, don't care. Oh, that was the end. Well, all right then. My bad, guys. I'm should have killed those other guys, which I was pleased to do. Anyway. Yeah, folks, that'll be that. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, you should like. If you didn't, you should dislike. We'll be back for the next episode of Wing tomorrow. We did all the quests we could, basically. Oh, hey, we got the limiter and the enhanced unit. That's useful. I have a bunch of those as well, so it's not all that useful. But we'll be back for a hero distracted by defeat. And a dude with a very long beard. I want to I meet that dude. He looks cool. But anyway, folks, good night.